Hello guys, this is Peggy. Today we're taking you to top five unique food in Taiwan. One of the best things about traveling is that you get to try different local food. When you're in the UK, you might want to try black pudding and you might want to try the raw octopus when you're in Korea. Now let's go have a look. What exactly are these top five unique food in Taiwan and what are they made of? Let's go. Number five, we're taking you to a special jelly, Ai Fu. This is how Ai Yu looks like. Ai Yu, it's not like this. Ai Yu is put in the bag. We want it to be soft, so we have to put it in the bag to grow. Then is there a specific condition to grow wild Ai Yu? 野生鳗鱼的生长条件的话，会需要在海拔一千公尺左右的位置，会需要潮湿、有点云雾缭绕的地方，所以阿里山是一个很棒的选择。Can I give it a try? 可以啊，一起啊。可以先抓住它，放在手掌心，那透过跟它的摩擦。So I just keep squeezing it. 对，去揉它。我们所谓的洗就是去揉这个动作。Okay. 嗯，让它的胶质你会感觉到会从你的指缝中溢出来的感觉。Oh, and what's the next step? 哦，我们会搓完，然后稍微把它搅拌均匀。Mm -hmm. 对，那我们再把它玉子整个拿起来，拧拧干，拧掉之后放着。Mm -hmm. 那这个部分就可以静置大概半小时，它待会干掉就会变得固态。Oh, we finally get it. So we just need to wait for it to solidify, and it will turn into ai yu jelly. So here we have the ai yu jelly we just made. I'd like to taste out the traditional flavor, lime and wintergourd. Lime zest does give a citrusy smell. I never know. Making ai yu jelly takes up such a complex process, and get to learn so much about it. I'm so glad that I have the opportunity to experience how to make this unique dessert you'll not find anywhere but here in Taiwan. It's definitely a must try. If you ever come to Taiwan, don't miss out.